Lunatic is a work by Nigel Tronach that was commissioned for National Dance Company Wales 10 years ago now. Nigel was always committed to entertaining his audience. He didn't want it to be highbrow. He really wanted an audience to feel like they were cared for, looked after, and a piece like Lunatic is just like that. The dancers wear expensive perfume so that when they come close to the audience, the audience will love that experience of being close to them. I came to the UK in 1993 when homosexuality was decriminalised in Ireland and I was coming to a UK that was still struggling with austerity, with the repression of the rights of a variety of different people and I know that when I saw the work of Nigel Charnock and others it was their determination to make space for people who were different, for the rights of all kinds of people to express themselves that made me feel that I could create and live uh, here. And I guess there may have been a time where we thought that those battles were over, that the fights were won, but now we realize that actually the progress in those areas around people's rights, whether it's women's rights, around gender, around sexuality, it's around class, all of those sort of things, they need to be fought for again. And Nigel's work, I think, is fresher than ever. It's alive and it absolutely speaks to the world, maybe even in a way that it didn't 10 years ago. And I think Nigel knew that because actually the work has references to the kind of 50s, to kind of that glamour uh, of a post-war period where people thought that everything was going to be okay, and then it wasn't. And I, I think he knew that progress isn't linear and that you have to keep on showing up or you have to keep on giving as much brilliant energy as possible. And, and that's what he's asked the dancers to do. He's not with us, which is very sad, but his energy is absolutely alive in the work and in the work of a new generation of dancers that didn't even know him. I think one of the great privileges of Remounting Lunatic has been that we've gotten to work with Nigel Tronick's estate, but also in particular his archives, both on video, his photographs, especially his diaries and workbooks, which are extraordinary resource. And the estate was really generous and brought those to us so that the dancers, who, who you know, many of them won't have known Nigel, got to really feel and, and know his work and, and kind of hear his voice and see him dancing. So why should people come? I think they should come because Nigel made work that absolutely had the audience, wanted to entertain the audience, wanted to look after the audience, and also wanted to show them what freedom could be. And I think all of the things that he wanted to express, that freedom that he wanted for us in the world, they're things that we need to keep on making possible for ourselves today.